The smoke has cleared. The stage has been set. For the first time in its illustrious history, the British Commonwealth Mid Heavyweight Championship will be decided in a triple threat match. And things are underway in today's main event. A terrific Troika representing the WOW and Greg Pistol Pollock, Tiger Khan, and Principal Richard Pound, and Banyu's already, I thought, I was just going to say, a hun only alliance had been formed between the Shark Tank and the Honor Roll. But just as I was going to say that, Tiger Khan is taking shots at Principal Richard Pound. Let me tell you something. It's every man for himself. But you know something, moron? I'm sitting here. I'm having bad flashbacks. And the flashbacks are, this Pollock looks like a young dynamite kid or Chris Benoit. And some of the matches I had with that, I'm having bad uh, flashbacks here. He has been favorably compared to the likes of dynamite kid. Oh. Of Benoit because of moves like that, a sunset flip from the top. And Principal Richard Pound now in the second row drops the chalupa in the form of an elbow on Tiger Khan. Goes for the cover and Pollock breaks that spinning attempt. Of course, Pollock, as you mentioned, compared to the likes of Dynamite Kid, the Dynamite Kid, one of the legendary performers, a man who transcended the sport, has published his autobiography, as we see a nice hip toss there by Pollock, and you can order the Dynamite Kid biography, Pure Dynamite, by logging on to www.dynamitekid.com. It's a tome, I'm sure. Let me tell you something. There's no way, shape, or form that I would order, or if somebody give it to me, I wouldn't want that book. Because I can imagine some of the stuff that he's saying in there. It'll be an interesting it's all lies. Tiger Khan now goes to work on Principal Richard Pound. Now he'll even things a bit as he now goes to work on Greg Pistol Pollock. Let me ask you a question. Who's your money on in this uh, triple death? I don't want to go out on a limb and make any prognostications. Oh, come on, any of these man. competitors would be a well accepted champion i would say i'm trying to find the right words because you put me in a corner here you painted me into a corner because no, you have to be a man you have to step up and say okay who greg pistol pollock then greg pistol pollock look at this okay you know who my mind is on mamma mia can you believe that what an idiot the guy must be nuts wipes out con and pound all at the same time sends con smashing into the steel guardrail who's your money on my money's on the winner or, or should i say who is your uh my money's on the way. Money. Don't worry about where my money comes from. There's a vicious rumor going around. I got my money illegally. Something tells me Pollock's going to need eyes in the back of his head in this one. Now going to work on Pound with those right hands. A poke to the eye. Stops that. That's legal in Harlem, too. And now there you see Tiger Khan nursing his injuries on the outside. A suplex on the inside by Principal Richard Pound. He's going for the cover. Will he be the new Commonwealth champion? No! Only by a hair. Two and nine tenths. Two and nine tenths. That should have been a four already. There's a nice left-handed jab to the chin of Greg Pistol Pollock. And Tiger Khan perhaps maybe doing the smart thing here. Taking a break on the outside while these two beat the hell out of each other on the inside. DDT plants well, Pollock. I tell you, the principal's giving that young boy a good old-fashioned beat. Referee Oscar Wilde now. Oh, come on already. Two count. I could have counted to 50 up. by now. Tiger Khan still on the outside, and he's taking a sweet time of getting back into this fray. As an investor, I'm going to have to check this referee out here, because I bet you the Hart brothers are behind this. Another jab by Principal Richard Pound. There is a veteran maneuver on the part of Principal Richard Pound. Demonstrating some of his wiles, raking the face of Pollock on his laces. Tries for the hangman's neck breaker. It's reversed by Pollock, and he hits a neck breaker of his own. Don't get excited. You're going to have a heart attack over here, and I'll have to do the show by myself. Oh, and Tiger Khan short circuits that pinning predicament. He needs eyes behind his head. Only a two count by Pollock. And now Tiger Khan puts the boots to Principal Richard Pound. Triple threat rules for the first time ever. A belt that was formed in 1978. Khan going for the pump handle slam here. Sit out side bomb. And this could be it. Hooks a leg, only a two. I was alluding to the fact. Let me ask you a question here. Who are some of the winners of this belt? 1978, Dynamite Kid, the first champion, defeating Coswell Martin in a tournament to establish the title. Held the belt on four occasions. Current WOW Commissioner Bruce Hart, an unprecedented six-time champion. Every Hart member of the Hart Wrestling Dynasty held the belt. What's Principal Richard Pound here doing? He's got that strap. He's a good old-fashioned licking. That's what he's doing. He has a... My kind of guy. Partner here now in the form of a strap-strapping Tiger Khan. Other winners of the Commonwealth title. 
Dino, Davy Boy Smith, Johnny Smith, a veritable who's who in the wrestling world has held this prestigious belt as we see principal side slam. I noticed you didn't mention my name, did you? Well, you were a uh, you were a perennial North American. That's right. Holder. You got that right. You were a heavyweight. That's man. right. This is the 225 pound limit. Now William Yates has Greg Pistol Pollock on the outside, ramming oh. his hand into the door here at the pavilion. All hell once again breaking that Pollock, loose. I'm going to make him pay for that door. Abdominal stretch there by Principal, broken up by a hip toss by Tiger Kama. Look at him. He is on dizzy drive here. Yes, for sure. All I'm going to make Pollock pay for that door, though. He just dented it. As a stockholder, I, I guess that would be in your best interest. That's right. Yes. Principal Richard Pound now got red suplex, beautifully executed. All these wrestlers pulling on all the stops. They know what's on the line. The British Commonwealth. Come on. What did I tell you? There's a referee Oscar That's Wilde. A, what is he doing outside out of position? He should have counted to 100 already. Only a two count, and perhaps referee Oscar Wilde. I bet you you had something to do with this. You hired this guy, didn't you? I hired no one, my yeah. friend. I'm not a stockholder like some people I okay, know. Okay, I'm going to have to check into this. Is this referee? I don't know. Rear chin lock being applied now by Principal Richard Pound as he neutralizes Tiger Khan. Meanwhile, Greg, what the hell is referee Oscar Wilde doing? Anyway, Greg Pistol Pollock is being brutalized on the outside by William Yates. What do you mean? They're teaching the young boy a little technique and a little about what this business is about. Again, the argument, we give rise to the argument that this type of a matchup needs two referees at least. Greg Pistol Pollock has been busted wide open. I'm going to make him pay for this. I'm going to make him pay for this table, too. He's got blood all over it. Him over here with his big head and dent at the table. Greg Pistol Pollock shedding the blood. He knows about all the blood, sweat, and tears that it took to reach this point. And right now, the principal in his honor roll taking liberties on Pollock. Principal Richard Pound meets Tiger Khan with a boot to the face and a hooking lariat levels Tiger Khan. This referee is so slow, I can't believe it. Only the principal should have won this a hundred times already. And that Pollock's paying for this table. He's got blood all over it, and he's got a dent in it. I can't believe it, but I'm about to agree with Van News Allen. Referee Oscar Wilde perhaps in over his head in this encounter. Oh, he's totally lost. Tiger Khan working on Principal Richard Pound. Meanwhile, now, Yates and Mandy, the fish Mancini on the outside. This thing is a beer six brawl. This thing is absolutely gone crazy. The action that only WOW can deliver, and we'll continue with more action right after this. Don't you go anywhere. Tonight at 11, Mark Wahlberg in Fear on A-Channel. Alberta winters can be unpredictable, but your natural gas bill doesn't have to be. Introducing the Equalizer from Atco Gas. 12 months, 12 equal payments. The Equalizer takes all the guesswork out of your monthly gas bill. This makes so much sense. The Atco Gas Equalizer. Call toll-free. 1-877-ATCO-GAS. It's simple. ATCO Gas. Still the one. Hello. It's Patrick. He took out life insurance. Your mother and I just took out life insurance from Norwich Union. Have you thought about it? Dad, I'm only 40. Norwich Union has a plan for people as young as 40. Besides, you have one good reason right over there. Take a look. Norwich Union is pleased to bring you Guaranteed Life Plus, affordable life insurance for people 40 to 75. Your acceptance is guaranteed. You're under no obligation, and no salesperson will visit. Call now for your free information kit. Premiums start from as low as $9.95 a month, no matter how old you are, and they'll never increase. Guaranteed. So call now. You'll enjoy coverage up to 25000 depending on your age and the premium you choose. In case of accidental death, your beneficiary receives five times your coverage, up to 125000 Thanks, Dad. I'm going to call Norwich Union now. Call toll-free, 1-877-789-7885, extension 285. You're right, Dad. It's never too soon to plan ahead. Experience the hard-hitting and high-flying competition of Stampede Wrestling. Friday, November 12th at the Stampede Pavilion, it's a scrap for the strap. As Principal Richard Pound clashes with hotshot Johnny Devine. Plus, Big Daddy Marvin Pope takes on Jason the Sledgehammer Neidhart. And it's Tiger Khan against Greg Pistol Pollock. All that and much, much more. Get your tickets at the door or call the Stampede Ticket Office now for prime advanced seating. Stampede Wrestling at the Stampede Pavilion. See you there.
Back Wrestling fans, the action's still hot and heavy. This ring area resembles a war zone back. This reminds me of my hometown, Harlem, and Saturday night after everybody had a few drinks and a few puffs. You know what this reminds me Puck of? The glory time. days of watching Bad News Allen and the other illustrious stars of Stampede Wrestling during the glory years. And I know that's why you're here, Bad News, is to bring back those glory years. You got that right. This is the new Stampede Wrestling. We got new talent here, but we're going to bring back the old days where you had some good butt kicking. Exactly. It's old school, and it's still cool. Stampede Wrestling. Oh, and Tiger Khan! Like a battering ram, head first into the wall. Principal Richard Pound with a pile driver on Greg Pistol Pollock. I'm going to make Pollock pay for that door also. The action is, oh, you're going to make Pollock pay for this. That's right, because he started it. He showed those guys run into the door and break it, so I'm going to make it pay also. The action of pay for and Jerry Owen at Singapore Kane and shot over Tiger Cod. He has now been lacerated. The bloodletting continues in the main event here this afternoon on Stampede Wrestling. Pound now in the cover. Only a two count. I'm telling you, this referee is unbelievable. I'm going to have to check into this. I bet you the Hart brothers are behind this. The action is unbelievable. It has left me for one breathless. And you at home as well. Principal Richard Pound driving his fingers. Look at the demonical look on his face. I love it. Pollock. Going to teach the young boy a little lesson in respect. Bleeding from the forehead. Pollock has earned the respect of each and every one of the raucous crowd here at the venerable Victoria Pavilion, the British Commonwealth Mid-Heavyweight Championship on the line. Let me tell you something. As a stockholder, after he gets beat this match, he's going to have to clean that match. Pound now with a camel clutch on Pollock. This brings back nightmares. That's how I used to do dynamite. This kid reminds me of him. Dynamite Kid, the first British Commonwealth mid heavyweight champion, 21 years ago, held the title on four different occasions. Bruce, Keith, Owen, and Bret Hart, also Commonwealth champions. Davy Boy Smith, a British Bulldog. Oh, and a chair shot by Tiger Khan out of left field. And one for the principal. And Tiger Khan now cleaning house as he wants to be the next Commonwealth champ. And what's he doing? Oh, my God, is he's going for a table. Oh, this is unbelievable. The old days when you had nothing but action. He's hardcore wrestling. Brought out the furniture. You talk about hardcore. One of the most hardcore matches I have seen in the history of WOW. Triple threat rule. I don't care what you say. The principal should have been the champ. He won it. He beat the man 15 times already. Oh, well, the principal right now losing his wrestling. injuries. And you Jerry see Logan. Tucker Khan ramming the head of Pollock into that table. I'm writing this down. Pollock's going to have to pay for that table, too. The table has been entered into play here. And we have Yates and Mark the Shark wielding chairs in Singapore canes. Tiger Khan now. Top up. Losing his balance, and he'll have to go back to work on Great Pistol Pollock, and that's exactly what he does. That's right. Yeah, that's a smart thing to do, see? Pollock's going to have to pay for that table. Tiger Khan, with an ally in the form of that table, continues to demolish, dismantle Greg Pistol Pollock. The fans here at the pavilion are in shock. Their hometown hero is being destroyed at the hands of the Calcutta Crusader here. Tiger Khan, what's he going to do? Stop him. tell you something. As one of the principal stockholders here, Pollock is going to pay for that table because he moves out the way and it's broken. Tiger Khan wipes himself out as Pollock had the presence of mind to move. He's now suplexed back into the ring and principal Richard Pound is going back to work on Greg Pistol Pollock. Tiger Khan could be crippled after that scintillating somersault sent on going through the table. He has to be seriously hurt. I tell you one thing, he may be hurt, but Pollock is not going to get no paycheck this evening. All his money is going to repair for all the damage he's done. Backflip from the corner. Close line by Pollock. And the crowd now on its feet. Greg Pistol Pollock on Fuego. Right hand to the side of the head. He is peppering principal Richard Powell. Irish whip now. Comes off the ropes. Beautiful flying elbow. The fans now will look at this crowd in the pavilion standing on it. Calm down, calm down. They are electrified. Don't 
get excited. The battle has just begun. Big back body drop now. Best of all, drops the knee in the middle of the forehead. The battle has just begun. Calm down. Another knee drop. What more can you ask for? The WOW delivering professional wrestling is paid now. When I saw yeah, the ground champion. Smart. I told you, calm down. That was a smart move. The man knows what he's doing in the ring. Only a two count. And can you believe this? Tiger caught back on his feet. Jawbreaker there by great Mr. Pollock of principle. But I cannot believe the intestinal fortitude of Tiger Khan. Yeah, the man's a warrior. What do you expect? He's a warrior. He's Pollock not going to give up. Like for Tombstone. Tombstone Pollock. This could be it. Greg Pistol Pollock now. What's what he idiot. doing? The kid's stupid. After me, I don't understand his motive here as I think he has. Principal Pound right for the picking. Going up for another high risk maneuver. Top rope. Tiger Khan, though, you can see him. Oh, and he squatches. Smart ball. Pollock in the corner. So Tiger Khan assisting Principal Richard Pound. And what's going on here? William Yates, I think he just had it. Whoa, whoa, what are you talking about? Look at your hero over here. No, no, wait a minute. Richard in pain and he's crying like a baby. Principal Richard Pound has just been given a foreign object by no William Yates. I didn't see anything like that. I told you I'm going to have to get you some new glasses. Another left hand there by Principal Richard Pound. Full scoop and a slam on Pollock. Tiger Khan still nursing the injury after that. Unbelievable somersault sent on from the top rope through the table. He is back in the ring, but not much of a factor right now. Principal Richard Pound hooking the legs. Look. Grab the truck. What's going on? Go! No! That's no! It. That's no! It. <laughs> no! <laughs> Principal Richard Pound has just been crowned the British Commonwealth Mid Heavyweight Champion for the second time in, the, in his many weeks. Another miscarriage of Justin Daniels. You need to go. He control. got beat one, two, three in the middle of the ring. That Pollock, first of all, like I said, is one of the principal stockholders. He's not getting paid tonight because he broke up all the furniture. Forget the hyperbole. That was a battle for the ages. The British Commonwealth Mid Heavyweight Championship triple threat match will go down in the books as one of the very best WOW has ever had. And begrudgingly, I have to say, you just ran because you owe me another five dollars because I picked him as the winner. Unbelievable action here this week, but Principal Richard Pound pulls it out. The coronation, you see the celebration now, the champagne about to be caught by a man who definitely deserves an assist. In fact, he, they should maybe replicate the belt and give one to you. Like I said again, not only am I going to get you a pair of glasses, but I'm going to bring you a CNI dog and a cane. Because you can't see, he beat that man one, two, three in the middle of the ring. Now, I know you've had serious knee problems, so I'm not going to ask you to get in the ring, but uh, begrudgingly, I'm going to have to go in there and talk. To I want you to congratulate him and tell him what a great champ he is. All right, wrestling fans, we've just witnessed an incredible exciting triple threat title match for the British Commonwealth Mid Heavyweight Championship. I am still speechless. I am breathless. And begrudgingly, I have to congratulate a man who by hook or by crook is the new British Commonwealth Mid Heavyweight Champion, the Principal Richard Pound, still jubilant, still celebrating with the honor roll. And at this time, I'd like to ask the esteemed wife of the British Bulldog, Davy Boy Smith, Mrs. Diana Hart Smith, to make the presentation the prestigious British Commonwealth Mid Heavyweight Championship is going around the waist of the principal. Whether you like it or not! And it simplifies that a heart is going to put the gold around a true champion's waist. Go to it, cuts! All right, Diana. I can't blame her. After all of the uh, pot shots and the affronts that you've given the Hart family, maybe that's uh, well-deserved. <laughs> Isn't it, Diana? I, I didn't really uh, think that the way that you won the belt was uh, very honorable. I think that uh, Greg Pollock deserves this belt. I think many of the fans here at the Pavilion would concur that Greg Pistol Pollock would make a much better champion in any event. It is now around your waist. You're, you're uh, d a disgrace. You cheated entirely through that match. I, I think that you should... Uh, forfeit that belt right now. I think a lot of fans here tonight will echo her sentiments. What I have to tell you, Diana Hart, you're no better than any Hart 
in this stinking town of Calgary because I came from Ontario and I did what I said and I captured the gold. Your problem, young toots, is that your old man down there, Stu Hart, he's a yellow sap. Hey, 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 All come his on. sons, shut Enough. your mouth. I'm not done. His sons are yellow saps and you are the biggest coward of them all. I just look at your husband, the British Bulldog. He is the lowest form of crap I've ever seen. And maybe, just maybe, I should turn to Davy Boy Smith and say your heart is not where your mouth is and neither is yours because your old man should have taught you a lesson. All right, wrestling fans. Your mother is a no good tramp. This is unbelievable. Oh, jeez. Well, that was well worded. What's going on here? Now, wait a minute. Shut up. Okay, this is ridiculous. Let's get some help from the back. Okay, we need some wrestlers from the back. This is ridiculous. Wait a minute, Terry Smith. Terry Smith and his daughter. Diana Smith. Oh my! Going to work on the other one now. I'm going to clear out of here. Diana Smith coming to the. She's a Smith. typical heart. No Here respect representing for nobody. the heart wrestling dynasty, what was supposed to be an honorable moment. She was she just saying exactly. what was on her mind, was attacked brutally, I might add, by the honor roll. This is far from over. Something tells me that the British Bulldog and the rest of the hearts will not rest until the principal Richard Pound. She got exactly what she deserved. You step in that square circle, you start slapping people, throwing that belt down, she got what she deserved. It's obvious we are not going to agree on this matter. More exciting action. One of the most memorable editions of Stampede Wrestling has come to an end. For Bad News Allen, I'm Moral Ranallo. See ya. Hey.